What's going on, guys? Your boy, Joey Shakes, coming to you guys over there right now. Right guard, Brandon Brooks, got his contract restructured. Um, and holy shit, they just saved about $6.3, $6.4 million in cap space. And uh, Brandon Brooks will make a base salary of about $4.7 million uh, this year. Um, wow. Uh, I did not think that this would happen. And I don't know why the Eagles need more cap space. We had enough cap space for our draft pick, so that's about $5 million. But with Daryl Worley off the team now, the team actually got back everything, uh, to about $2 million in cap um, for Daryl Worley, which signed with the Raiders. He can go fuck himself, and the Raiders could have that piece of shit. Um, I really I couldn't believe that Brand Brooks, man, like just, you know, thought about – it was we're going to help Nick Foles, give him more money, more incentives, more everything. Um, you know what I mean? Just get more money this year, a, a, a bigger signing bonus. Which um, Brandon Brooks was on um, Truce, was on, which he was on Quick Slants with Lane Johnson talking about how, you know, he wanted to help him out. And I know the team wants to restructure, but at the same time, um, I don't know why the Eagles need more cap. I mean, the more cap, the better right now. But... I don't know if they're trying to make a move or maybe there is a trade that they're trying to make. Um, I have no idea. This could be a possibility, but for a player like Brandon Brooks to, you know, he got his first Pro Bowl. He's really enjoyed being in Philadelphia, knows the difference between the Philadelphia front office from the Houston um, front office. And um, you couldn't ask for more out of a player. You know what? I like this team the way they are. They're, you know, if players are fucking up in Philadelphia, not even playing a snap, they're getting rid of them in two seconds. Besides the Michael Bennett shit, because the Michael Bennett shit's bullshit anyway. Um, this is a very serious organization. I mean, there are second chances, but it depends on what is going on, how bad it is. Don't need the distractions at all. So with Brandon Brooks coming in and getting his you know getting you know another 6.3 million is 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 saved for the Eagles cap now I don't know if the Eagles are getting ready for the future are the Eagles getting ready to sign Brandon Graham are the Eagles ready to um get some money together so they could pay Carson Wentz in two years um you know what I mean so there's a whole lot that goes into it but I could see a, a, a trade happening maybe a possibility of a trade happening uh, with how much cap I don't know how much cap we have total wise but um, it's amazing, man. Brandon Brooks has just been an absolute, you know, guard. I mean, I've never even watched. If you don't notice an offensive lineman playing, you know they're doing their job, and everyone has done their job, done their part. And Brandon Brooks made his first Pro Bowl. And he is – we literally have a Pro Bowl offensive line. Pretty much, if you don't really count Wisniewski, of course. But um, – Jason Peters in there. Vitae played absolutely amazing this year. So the good to have him as well. Um, you know, so there's a lot that goes into that. But I really enjoyed Brandon Brooks the way, you know, he's played. He's, he's taken the city under his arms. And, uh, you know, he's made a big difference on this offensive line entirely. So that was a great signing a few years ago. Uh, so I'm, I'm happy we have him around. So with all this cap now, you know what I mean? I know we got at least over what? We got to have at least, what, like maybe 10, 11 million? I don't know. I'm just guessing maybe 10, 11 million in cap space. I have no idea. But you know what else is amazing? Bram Brooks never gave up a sack this year for the Eagles. Actually, since he's been playing with the Eagles, I don't think he's given up one sack this year. Um, I read some on Pro Football Focus, and I thought that was kind of interesting because not many people get around him. And uh, people have beaten Lane Johnson, Jason Peters, but Brand Brooks has been that guy that nobody really beats. Um, so I'm happy about that. So let me know what you think about the restructure. Um, I understand down the road it's going to be a nice cap cap hit because the more restructures, you're taking less money now, more bonus money now, less um, more bonus money now, and and more of a, a payday later. Um, he'll have like a five million cap hit probably by next year. After this year, by next year, but well worth it. 
Um, so let me know what you guys think about the uh, restructure. And, um, you know, I, I really like this. I do. So we'll see what happens. But that's all I got to say, guys. So uh, just chilling out. Um, and that's it. So fly goes fly. Shake squad up. Peace.